And we are back, everybody. Yo, yo, yo. <laughs> Let's get things get started. Uh, I can't even talk. <laughs> I might have caught something when I jacked into that corpo's bile mine. No, uh, neurovirus. Or... Need to see Feeling sick. Let him tell me what's got my head reeling, my stomach churning. Okay, let me take you. I brought you a ride. Throwing some threads, meet me downstairs. E, let's go. Let's lock our door. Don't want no creep coming in here. Oh, who's this now? Regina Jones here. If you're looking for work in Watson, give me a call. How'd you find me? How'd you even know my name? I know where to gather my intel. Could even call me a collector. Later, B. All right. Let's sell some stuff. Stuff we don't need. Okay. Yeah, don't need that. Coolio. Coolio. And... Yeah, we gotta throw our junk in there, too. Nice. Ooh. Should we kill him? Should we kill him, guys? Not yet. We're not that powerful yet. Let's not... Let's not test our luck. I don't know. I did say we're gonna try this without dying. So ah, we're gonna have to walk away. We're gonna walk away from that. <laughs> Once we get more guns and have more ammunition and everything, we'll go kill it. Bounce, bounce, bounce. Hey, yo, v. Oop, I'm How calling. about a round or two? What do you say? How you like my new punching bag? Just gave me a next gen ass whooping. He did. Be curious to see how he handles the likes of V. All right. <laughs> so how about it? Let's do, Let's do this. Light on your feet. Keep that head moving. All right. Let's go. Come on, come on. Ooh. Dodge, dodge, punch, punch. Yee, yeah, buddy. Mm. What's that blocking? You got one hell of a punch there, Jim. Yee, yeah, buddy. Monetizing it? I can arrange a fight or two. What do you say? Uh. For sale. Only top shelf gear. Let's see what he has for guns. Not really in a mood to be fighting right now. Uh, he has a katana. I don't think we need that. Really? This does more damage to the katana. You know, let's say for money we don't need anything right now. Oh, we're still in the Okay, let's where's the story? Oh, main top right here. Wait, why isn't it following the main story, dude? Oh, I didn't hit track. Neck. <laughs> Neck. <laughs> Alright. Let's go, let's go. Oh, this takes a while.
Open up, open up. Oh, what's this? Oh, cool. Mm. Man of the hour. <laughs> Sheesh. Took you long enough. Worked up an appetite just waiting. Sit down. Let me finish this. Then we can drop in on Senor Vector. They were right, they right. Mentioned something about a surprise yesterday. Am I remembering right, or just had a brain fart? Probably both, because you usually forget shit. <laughs> it just so happens, I think I might have bagged us a sweet-ass J-O-B. Go on. I mean, maybe it's not as big as that, but... Just that it's fronted by a little-known someone named Dexter Deshaun. Only the top fixer in night fucking city. Fat-ass black Jesus of the afterlife. 300 pounds apart. The one thing I have to admit I'm quite noticing, a lot of the bugs and glitches, they're quite nicely gone. As I said before, normally there was like trees in their faces, and now it's not, so it's very nice. We meant to come out in one piece? Our Lord and Savior wants to tell you everything himself, face to face. Oh, no pressure, but uh, his whole deal, he's riding on you now, I see. All right. Let's hear what old Dex has to say. Set it up. Dex is a real deal when it comes to fixers. Don't get me wrong. Don't got nothing against the Padre or Wakako, but Dex is in a league of his own. You know what I'm saying? Sure. No. I don't know what this guy's talking oh, about, but sure, sure why not? <laughs> Let's just go with turf. it. Local fixer waves his dick around, but he's smiling. Saying you'll be up to your neck in gigs and eddies. Still, all you are is another name in their little black book. Nifty tool for getting them a fat slice of whatever half-baked shit pie their client put on the table. Sure, you crack jokes over drinks, but in the end, it's biz. Gracias a Dios. Estoy lleno. Brought your wheels. Gave them to my guy yesterday to smooth over the dents after our, uh... Thanks, Jay. Thank you, thank you. Gave my car back. I love the fact cars are just. <laughs> it's just a. Uh, like, there's no keys. It's just a. Uh, literally a card. Some top notch work Miguel did. Alright, we're getting up. We'll see about that. So we rolling or what? Alright, let's bounce. Let's feel this factory new ride. Let's bounce out of here. Where's my. Or I'm guessing it's yeah, right here. Oh, it looks looks nice. First stop, Ripper Duck. Ah, oh. and Holmes. Easy Switch camera gas, view. Huh? There we go. I just did. No, we ripping this. I was supposed to stop by Vix anyhow. I got a date. The end, Miss D. You don't say. Another date, date, my friend. She's so sweet. Really gets me, you know. Huh. All right, let's go, let's go, let's go. Yeah, this is it. Come on, V. Find me once Vic's done dusting your circuits. We'll hash out what Dex has cooked up for us. All right, cool. Yo, hey, who got my way? Damn. What did you do? Dr. Vector will see you now. Thank you, thank you. Vicky, surprise him. Ah, super dog. Ripper. It's good to see you. Good to see you too, V. It's been a while. To what do I owe the pleasure today? Last gig. Had to jack into a client's neuro socket. Think I might have gotten spiked. Experiencing migraines, nausea, hypersensitivity to bright lights. Yes. <laughs> oh, kid, doodle. <laughs> All right, kid. We'll sort you out in a flash. Besides that, how are things? Need some new kit, but tools, not toys, Vic. Time I bumped up my sights and got a grip. 
<laughs> really? Now? Finally? Vic, shit's getting real. Got a job from Dex to Sean, hitting the major leagues. Need tech that can perform. The Dexter Deshaun? <laughs> well, that is something. But let me guess. Hasn't paid you yet. Quit crying, Vic. I'll bring you the Eddies later, with interest. You know I will. Hmm. Last I don't time. know. It'll be yeah, promising stuff. stuff. I never said I was going to pay. pay. <laughs> Chair, please. Sit down. Relax. Thank you, senor. Kuroshi Optics. Best I've got, and should be about right under the circumstances. Can you imagine getting your eye changed like that? I don't know, that just messed. Now, Jack, in. Honestly, that's gonna be us, like, in the future, you know? You peruse and choose while I scan. Ch changing stuff, getting our limbs all changed out. Future's gonna be crazy. Alright. Uh, Haynes, what are we putting on? Let's hold up. Okay, we don't need that. Eh, we don't need anything. Mark one, like I said, decent enough scanner. Displays data on your cornea. Cherry on the top's a built in external lens disruptor. In layman's terms, any surveillance cam will capture your face as a blur. And just remember, your body will still show up as crystal clear. Hmm. Mm -hmm. This should do the trick. Talks to Kuroshi Tech, too. I'm ready. Carve away. Excellent. Let's carve away. away. Hey, carve, carve on my body. body. <laughs> It's all good. Major League arm of yours right here. Just like that. Thanks. Now, a bit of anesthetic and I can start cutting. I bet you better put a lot. <laughs> Feel anything? Play by play, though. Really, Doc? Makes it sound like a dentist. Always going on and on. Don't be mean now. Remember, I'm old. I got a shaky Gannick hand. Could slip. Lights out for a minute, all right? Ooh. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh. Taking, Taking up my, my eye. Sounds like a typewriter. Okay, let's test this. See the magic in action. Linking you in. You might feel a little discomfort at first. Blurred vision, low contrast, glitches. Well, how's it look? Feel all right to you? Oh, this is fantastic, Vic. How oh, beautiful. All right, scan cool. It might take you a few seconds to adjust, but first time's rarely the charm, <laughs> with anything, really. Scanner should eventually sync with your thought processes and read your intentions. I also what the NCPD that'd be cool system. honestly being able to do that with your eyes like in real life <laughs> scan <laughs> it auto worked like a charm now draw your weapon you should see your ammo count in a brand new sight Shit, Victor, not bad. I don't know what to say. Say you'll take this and remember the dosage. Two whiffs now, and another two in an hour.
Thanks again, Vic. You're the best. I owe you. Go on, kid. All right. What you're made of. And once you hit the big leagues, don't forget where you came from. Damn straight. Never do. That's what we're not doing when we do hit the big leagues. Yo, you gotta remember the roots. Oh, cat. Okay, what did I just walk into? But you'd have to watch out for negative energy fields and avoid mean reds. V, yo, listen up. I talked to Dex while you were in with the doc. He's waiting in his ride for you. Ain't but a hop to where he's parked next to Gramsci Burgers. Okay, do my best to talk us up. Cool, 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 cool. V, listen, I've got this delicate matter. That's why I called you. The number of cyber psycho attacks in this city is on the rise. Now that's probably not news to you, but this issue matters to me for a few reasons. There are people who say cyber psychosis can be treated. Right. And I know exactly how that sounds, but I believe even an unproven therapy is still better than a bullet to the brain. If I get a tip about a possible attack, I'll give you a call. Maybe you can investigate before Max Tack hits the scene. But remember, sure. you're not there to execute anybody. Try to incapacitate the attacker, and I'll send someone to pick him up. I hope that's all clear. Girl, can you stop, stop talking? talking? <laughs> <laughs> of course. Alright. Yo, I like his shoes. Wait, I just noticed that. Yo, Mr. V. Yo, he has some nice shoes. Dexter Deshaun in the flesh. Yo. Ample indeed. <laughs> Let's roll. I wonder if we can get the shoes. Mind if I ask you something right off the bank? What'd he do? Would you rather live in pieces, Mr. Nobody, die ripe, old, and smelling slightly of urine, or go down for all times in a blaze of glory, smelling near like posies, without seeing your 30th? Uh, You're either somebody, or you fizzle out into nothing. Night City don't let you choose. Oh, but it does. See, in my line of work, I choose to be Mr. Chill, but folk who try to take advantage, well, they see the beast inside. All right, listen close. Talk about secondhand smoke. Let me hear it. What's the job? There's this prototype tech, a biochip to be precise. My gosh, that smoke. Simple. Yeah. Guessing it belongs to a corp. Mm-hmm. Arasaka. Surely that's no problem. No. Nah. <laughs> Corps don't deserve special treatment. Shit. <laughs> you ain't playing around. Got a feeling this could be a start of a beautiful friendship. Show me the next target. target. Let's go. You work this out? Got a plan? Two things. First, a conundrum with the Maelstrom boys. Needs act to resolve in that. Second to rendezvous. Simple. Client who brought us the job's anxious. She wants to parlay with one of the team. Parlay? Parlay? <laughs> What's the issue needs resolving with Maelstrom? Got a beef? Slot in the shard. I got a classic tale for you. Psycho gang doing his thing two weeks back. Jumped a Militech convoy. Got away with the gear. Corp don't even know Maelstrom's involved. Now see, convoy was carrying the flathead, a little combat bot, a prototype. And I don't right. need that bit of high grade military tech. Because if we don't get that bot, we don't get no soccer chip. And sure. we sure as hell don't get no happily ever after. But don't get excited. It's a single-use toy. Now, I flat out purchased the damn thing from Maelstrom. Problem is, I did so from a gent went by the name of Brick. I say when, because Brick was the leader. Three days after we'd sealed our deal, his friend and gangmate one Simon Randall, a.k.a. Royce, plain dropped his ass. Royce is in charge Ooh, now, right. and I got no way of knowing if he aims to honor his predecessor's word. 
To add to the shitstorm, one mayor of the south of Militech has developed an interest in said convoy. Who's the prima donna? Corpo agent, internal affairs. Been skidding around town asking after the convoy as if her life depended on finding it. The one lead she's got zip tied in her trunk. Stick up her ass ain't growing any shorter. So she must be getting desperate. Be wise to think how you could use that. Of course, to do so, you'll need that frazzled cat's info. Sending it now. Client, what's her thing? Why she need to meet? Woman's name I remember Mary hearing. Hardy. Like, you can choose to meet her or to not meet her. And my corporal gameplay, I met her. Street Kid, I didn't. But there's another cutscene that happens, so if you don't meet her, you're not gonna find the other uh, cutscene. So, we're gonna meet her in this one, and I wanna know what's that other cutscene that's been going around. So, let's see. T-Bug ain't no people person, and Jaggy's only good at some things. I know you know what I mean. Pretty much leaves you. I think I got everything. Time I got to work. Well, that's just music to my ears. I'll set up the meet with Miss Parker at Lizzie's bar. Flathead, though, is gonna be all you. All right. One more thing, Mr. V. Quiet life or blaze of glory? Hmm? Later now. Personally, I preferred the quiet life, but let's go. All right. Oh, we leveled up. Let's go. As I said before, getting those quick hacks up. Uh. Um, that's actually a pretty good one, I'm not gonna lie. So we'll get that, and... Yeah, we'll... Yeah, we'll level this up. Jackster, talk to Dex. <laughs> yeah, Gordito's a big deal. Literally a nine, yeah? Clint to want to check our pro cred. But to me, it feels more like he tangled us up with Maelstrom and Militech. There's this combat bot, military prototype. Maelstrom clepped it. Then Dex paid to take it off their hands just before the gang goons had a switch up in management. Right, right, heard about that. Royce versus Brick. Hostile takeover. That sums it up. Dex wants us talking to Royce. Gave the deets of some Militech agent, too, but... I don't know how much help she stands to be. Huh. <laughs> Then there's the Is other that thing. Got to meet the client who put the job on the table, Evelyn Parker. You? Well, what's Dex gonna do? Ride around in his limo, chat chicks up on the hollow? Pretty much. Parker wants to meet <laughs> someone on the crew. Dex gave me the nod. He must know what he's doing. So, how you wanna play this? Maelstrom or Parker? What's first? Uh, let's get all the talking out the way, man. I'm, I'm tired of this talking. Uh. Let's get started with the client. I think I ought to see her first. See what she's like, what she's after. In that case, I'll hit the all foods. Put my nose to the ground. Sniff around. Hasta luego. Uh. Okay, cool. Uh. Our ass is not walking. I ain't walking there. And there is my cup. Hey, let's go. Turning this radio off. Let's go. Alright, alright. 
right. Excuse me, coming through. Get out my way. Oh, dang. Oops. <laughs> Alright, here we are, here we are, here we are. Let's get out the car. We're closed right now. Howdy. Oh, wait. Can we, isn't there like a time to wait? Hold up, hold up, hold up. Okay, last time it was like, okay, we'll skip time. There was other times like you go there very early, though like you hit like the X button or something like that and it will just skip you to that time. All right, cool. Looking a little put out there, input. Interest you in a preem BD? Sure, and I go. Hold it, house rules first. There will be severe penalties for any unauthorized recording. No drugs, no groping. Yeah, we'll drive, behave. You do not grab them. You find them in the catalog, ask for a BD, and get yourself a box. I really look that green to you. Like I don't know. <sighs> mm-hmm, door's open. Thank you. Have fun, What if the Lizzie's? Hey. Get you something. I'm looking for Evelyn Parker. You know if she's here. Yep, exactly. right there. <laughs> Name's V. She and I have a uh, date. Well, V, it's a pleasure. I'm Mateo. Uh huh. So, Evelyn? Club's big. We're gonna have to look around. Can't do it for you. It's all right, Mateo. I was waiting for this one. I should shoot you for lying. <laughs> Evelyn Parker. I knew it was you as soon as you walked in. Why not say hello sooner? I wanted to get a good look at you first. Oh, you like the goods? <laughs> Why are we meeting here? Any particular reason? Actually, it doesn't seem much like your thing. This place. Mm -hmm. hmm. I'll take that as a compliment. Come on. No place we can talk where ears won't prick up to listen. We'll be in the lounge, Mateo. If anyone asks, we're not here. What can Nothing's wrong. Like really? Me? Why don't you just tell me the truth? Ooh, we know what kind of place we're in. <laughs> you guys heard that. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Hello. Dex had a load to say about you. Called you professional, yeah. effective, and trustworthy. I hope he wasn't over. Gotta fix our, fix our glasses. <laughs> you don't give a rat's dick what Dex thinks. We both know that. You have trouble accepting compliments. No, just think flattery's beneath you. The facts. I like it. Get straight to the point. Why are we here? Maybe Dex is beneath you. Hold up. What's good? I'm back. Sorry, someone's at the front door. <laughs> You know what things are. Oh, right. Just started working with him, in fact. I've heard there are two kinds of fixers. Those with stable crews on long contracts and short leashes. Loyalty and predictability they value above all else. Hand sanitizer, you know, guys? COVID's out there, you know, you gotta be careful. You always gotta be careful. Let's cut to the chase. What do you got for me? Your target. I trust you know what it is. Relic. Secure your soul trinket. Key tech in the program, actually. We're tangling with Arisaka, making this heist one dangerous, risky motherfucker. Darn straight. Arisaka's poured billions into personality transfer technology. But me, 
I just want the data on this one. The chip is tucked away inside Compeki Plaza, the hotel. You ever been? Classy Gorb hotels? Yeah, no. Out of my price range. Soon they'll be in our price range. <laughs> of course, to die for it. As you'll see for Do yourself. reviews for you guys. Go Where to new exactly? hotels and be like, yo, this is in a lit. Suite on the top floor. The room's occupied by Yorinobu Arasaka. Yorinobu Arasaka? He's in town? Don't you read the scream sheets? The media couldn't get enough of Yori coming to Night City. It was all over the headlines. Anyway, he's heir apparent to the Arasaka Empire. Saburo Arasaka's only surviving son. What? So Arasaka Jr.'s planning to grab the reins while in Night City? Only a handful of people in Night City know what the Arasaka's real plans are. Tell me you're one of them? Look, if you've got any spare aces up your sleeve, now's the time to show them. Now, this should make your prick perk up. Yorinobu recently swiped the chip from an Arasaka laboratory. He's made a deal with Netwatch. Aims to sell it to them. Okay. Have you spotted my ace yet, or do I need to spell things out? I think you might need to spell things out. Fine. <laughs> so no Arasaka security on the device, because Yorinobu whisked it away in secret. Now, where's he hiding it? Well, likely in a specialized container. One that mimics an organic neural environment. On the outside, it looks like an ordinary briefcase. And the case is... You'll see for yourself soon enough. Provided we're done gossiping about the Arasakas. Okay, what's next? Now comes the best part. Follow me. Got something for you. Should help you plan. Brain dance from Compeki Plaza. How's a brain dance supposed to help? Need facts, not thrills. <laughs> Think BDs are only good for fondling virtual tits, jacking off to in those boxes. Sure yeah. not. <laughs> it can be a very useful tool. Good for analyzing details, no, no, human perception, that. even boosted. Yeah, doesn't grasp exactly what you oh, need. So what's on the tape? Yorinobu's suite, the glorious interior. You'll need to locate the relic yourself. Hope I grabbed enough detail to make that possible. Hold up. Mean to say you recorded this? Mm-hmm. BD rec implant. Why, you object? No, not at all. Let's see this brain dance. Judy will help. She's a mox, too. Judy! <laughs> Years. V, this is important. Judy's always been there for me. Always helped out. I trust her. But she's a mox, not the latest member of your crew. Try not to forget. So, you'll be a good boy. Tread lightly and keep that tongue on a leash. I don't right. think that's gonna happen. Believe it or not, I'm no stranger to tact. In biz or life. Judy! <laughs> <clears throat> This is V. He's here for that BD role. And V, this is Judy. Best brain dance editor I know. Enough already. Gonna make me barf. Hey, Judy. Hey, Judy. <laughs> Compiled your BDF. What do you think? Will it do? Still pretty raw. But yeah, ought to do. Mm hmm. V needs to get deep inside. That's most important. So, let's calibrate. Tune it to him. Hey, thank you, thank you. Let's go. Believe me, I've dealt with worse. You should see the jig-jig street porn we gotta contend with sometimes. So, we drop V inside. Let him look, let him rummage around, right? How about it, V? Raw brain dance. Ever taken a dip before? Nope. <laughs> Look, I'm no BD virgin, but the raw stuff? Uncharted territory. Relax. I'll explain everything. It's less complicated than it sounds. Sit down. Settle in. And we'll get you going. All right. See less. Um, 
I'm trying to get my mouse back over here. Go. Got to create your sensory profile first. Okay. Hit me. Just promise me it won't hurt. It won't. Not this time. Now sit still. Not this go. time. <laughs> run the analysis. Nani? <laughs> Should feel a slight tingling. Mm-hmm. Look here at me. Okay, now let's set the optics and other sensory sigs. Look smack into these two screens. Pretend it's an eye exam. Uh, this is quite. Like, Am I gonna have to it's do quite this bright. calibration <laughs> dance every time? Not necessarily, but it's worth the wait. Give me two more minutes and you'll see exactly what BD analysis is capable of. One more sec. Need to get the pain receptor limiters in. Okay. All set. You need to test your profile first. Tossing in a sample BD. You can use it to get to know the editor. All right. Now let me see. Where could we? Can't he just use my recording? Why are we wasting time? So we don't risk our necks. Sides won't take a sec. Got something here. Should be perfect. Boot it up. Mm-hmm. Let me give you the tailored version first. Let you get your bearings. And we'll jump into editing mode. Be diving in in three, two, one. Ooh, right. Plan simple. Do nothing odd. Don't get creative. You go in, snatch the cash, get out. And we sell the BD to those psycho freaks from the studio. Got it, got it. And remember, everything on full blast. They'll spot us extra for a wicked adrenaline high. Okay, on you go. Okay, what's going on here? Robbing the store? Down, everybody! On the ground! What I see you kissing the flooring! Money! Now, or I will fucking drop you, I swear to God! Whoa! Yeah! Hey! Uh, uh, now! Before I blow your fucking head off! Slow, deep breaths. Your cortisol and adrenaline spiked, but the soft activated your hormone blockers. Nothing happened. You're alive and well. A flash of intense shock. I can still feel it, I remember. Facts. Fuck, that last second. You could've warned me how much it hurts to die. Trust me, real death hurts much, much more. Not so sure about that. You'll be fine. Got everything set up? You talk like it's from experience. <laughs> I'll sever the link to the BD Roller's sensory array. You'll be able to look around freely. Whole scene's yours. Full cam control in analysis mode. So move around, zoom in and out, whatever else you come up with. Think of it as your own little sandbox. So, analysis mode, you control playback. Can even pause when you feel the need. Then Plan you use simple. the editor Do console to unpause. Try it. You go in. Pause, unpause, pause, unpause. Yeah. Yeah, we sell the BD to those psycho freaks from the studio. Got it, got it. Dream as hell, right? No, that's not all. You can speed things up or rewind, whatever you like. Give it a try. Rewind. Yeah, Roll it back to the top. All good. Neat. Now try fast forwarding a bit. Plan simple. Okay. Okay. You can also reset the recording. That'll take you right back to the beginning. Try it. Now for some fun. This here's why you came in the first place. In analysis mode, you get to view and even scan details of the enviro recorded by the BD roller. Focus on the heat, the gun this gonk gets from his buddy at the beginning. Now scan it. Okay, well. Plan simple. Do nothing odd. Don't get creative. You go in, snatch the cash, get out. And we sell the BD to those psycho freaks from the studio. Got it, got it. And remember, everything on full blast. They'll spot us extra from the adrenaline hide. 
On you go. Okay, right here. Uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. Excellent. Let's move on. Now heads up. In analysis mode, you can ferret out background noise and conversations if the roller got close enough. This tech records everything, every little detail, even the sights and sounds the roller was never aware of. To see the sources of the recorded sensory signals, switch to the audio layer in the editor. Go ahead and try that now. Okay, good. Now you should see several sound signatures in the store. Choose one and hone in on it. A six case of Rosef and a couple of zappers. Okay, we have a deal today on two flavors Cody and no. Serpent. Everybody! Oh. So, any thoughts? Unbelievable. Seriously, like what's happening right next to me. Yeah, it's how BD recording implants work. They pick up everything, all the elements in the background. Then an editor tweaks them, makes them pop. Keep playing with the sound, explore it a bit. We'll move on when you get bored. Sorry, I gotta fix the headphones and my glasses, you know? <laughs> okay. Sometimes you can analyze extra layers in the raw. Stuff the roller is cyberware picked up. Like what? Ev's got Kiroshi optics that grab infrared. Meaning you should be able to grab heat signatures from her recording. Huh. <laughs> Hello, nice. Now let's wait till the guy punches out the gonk at the counter. On the ground! You wanna see a kiss in the voice, Scanning works on peeps, too. Walk up to the wounded chick. Try scanning her. Alright, next thing. Scroll forward to the part where our artist gets a lead injection. Now, or I will fucking drop you! I swear to God! Now! Come on, come on. See that? They shot him and he never saw it coming. But you will. Here it comes. My favorite part of the game. See the blinking thing over the entrance? Surveillance cam. Must have caught our shooter. You'll see in a sec. Cam feeds to the screen behind the clerk. Roll back to where the screen's in the kid's field of vision. Then scan it. Chumba shot him. Probably planned to all along. Must have got a nice slice of cred on the black market for a BD like this. BD freaks are ready to pay a preem for a real flatline. Anyway, mm -hmm. if you've seen enough, you can exit. Alright, man. One thing, I hate tutorials. <laughs> like, bro, they suck so much. <laughs> Just want to dive in. Yeah, it's impressive, right? Too bad most of the BDs we do here are only good for flogging the log. Anyway, you ready to do this? Look at your wreck? No way. Let's take a break. Still feel like that kid when... Oh, yeah. I think I'm done. V, there's no time. Get it together, please. Okay. Okay. Go ahead. Just need T-Bug to link in. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Who? Running for my crew, security specialist. She'll tell me what to look for while we analyze. No problem, I hope. Actually, it is a problem. Not what we agreed, Ev. Judy, T-Bug's a professional, discreet to a fault. You can trust her. Why? Cause you say so? Please, Judy. Someone's hiding something. <laughs> I never expose you to any danger. You know that. Call T-Bug and we'll dive in. Hey V, what's happening? Bug, listen. I got some useful footage from Kanpeki Plaza. It's a brain dance. Kanpeki? Oh, thought as much. Someone there with you? Unimportant, T-Bug. Please focus. Need your help. Got no clue what I'm supposed to look for once I'm in. Alright, see if I can walk you through it. Jacking into your tech now. Mm, you've got to give me access. 
Opening port 1779. Secure protocol? Good, I'm going in. That right away. Right. Getting my requests now. Got it. You ready? A millisec. Okay, connection confirmed. Now some quick temp ice, and we're clear. Ready to dance. Fire up, Judy. Scan, scan. Five cents. There we go. Alarm firmware's fresh, but saw excited birds chirping on a BBS. Something about lots of seeds falling to this sieve. Let me generate keys. I can forge their six. Okay, and this one. Come on. Cameras packed with new tech, motion sensors, heat sig activators, IFF. You skilled enough to kill it all? Mucho more than enough. Just need access to their subnet. Let's try to speed through this. I said no. Okay, where is? You should yeah. perish for good cause. But uh, make yourself comfortable. I need a minute. Listen in on that conversation, V. Could be something important. Yeah, it could be something. Where it is? No, we're already. Oh. Okay, that was nothing. Okay, can't go over there. Oh. I need a minute to finish. The program is still in the trial phase. We cannot take it to market as is. We shall see soon enough. Please speak with your father. He's taken a particular interest in this project. He can certainly explain the risks. My father is tired. Visual this old gray beard who thinks nothing will change and he'll live forever in his tiny frozen bubble. I should not even be listening to such things. You will listen to this. Saboroy is an adult. I'm leaving the range. Utterly removed from reality. Stuck in some fossilized vision of a world that no longer exists. Of a world that may never have existed. We have not seen eye to eye for the past 20 years. I am quite sure we won't now. Read the documentation carefully. The relic requires specific storage conditions. You must know that. them. You know. Heard that? Relic docks gotta be around here somewhere. Look for them. Cool. Okay, uh... Oh. Here in a drone. Ventilation and cooling? Servers. Gotta be. Fancy doodads in here need to be controlled. Okay, cool. Uh... How do we switch layers? Yep, there we go. Uh. Off. Okay. Let's we won. Okay, what is this thing we're missing? Hmm. Let's go forward. You wish to make an enemy. Okay. Any left? Step was step was so fast. Step was so was pretty fun last time. 
bedroom. Nice to have it. I've got an idea. Be right back. Loaded. Safety's on. Good to know, though. Once you're in there, don't forget about that iron. Yo, yo, that's facts. When I first played through it, I forgot about that gun. <laughs> Second playthrough, I, I went and grabbed it for darn sure. Okay, we're missing some stuff. Okay, we're gonna rewind and see if we can find all of this. Oh. Manual details a special tip controlled container. Relic needs to be kept real cool. So, chip's gotta stay in the freezer. Yep, could damage it otherwise. Okay, switch on thermal layer detection in the editor. Should be easier to spot where your Nobu's keeping the chip. Air conditioning, standard model for hotels of this caliber. Tip matches that stipulated in the docks, but no way the chip's hiding there. Too risky. Tip fluctuations, risk of damage. All right. Oh, Donna Geese. Looks like Mr. Arasaka had something to celebrate. Really think you'll find the chip in there? No way. Tim's too low. Could fluctuate. Nice try, though. Yeah, I know where the chip is, but like, gosh. <laughs> Just a fancy ass fridge. Tim and the chip the is over we'll here. here. Right, grab the heat sig. Matches the spec in the docks. Yorinobu's got the case here. Guaranteed. Mm-hmm. We got it. Good work. Looks like we got everything we need. Quit out of the editor. Yeah, we're bouncing out. Get everything you need? Yes, sir. Yeah. Uh, that'll do. Thanks, Judy. We got it. Later, T-Bug. Nice work today. See you soon. We're spam. I want cash and your data. You were never here. Keep it. I'll put it on Ev's tab. <laughs> Thank you. Portable device for handling BDs. I already uploaded your calibration settings. Not as sophisticated as what we got here, but should do the trick. And it keeps you out of harm's way. Clever. Speaking of harm's way, know what I see looking at you? Walking, talking corpses. We needed that recording, Judy. The BD practically does our job for us. The BD will be the death of us. Seriously. If Arasaka finds out you have it, you're dead. I'm dead. Judy, relax. Nobody will ever know. Evelyn, please. No shortcuts. You go that route, city will always win. So be careful. Of course I will be. Besides, we'll talk in a bit. So, we talking? Let's walk. So much talking, people. I just want to start shooting. <laughs> well, what do you think? So, what now? V, do this job for me. 
I mean me alone. No splitting the payout with anyone else. No middlemen. No decks. You guys are seeing that, right? <laughs> you guys are seeing that, right? <laughs> if I agree, they'll be hell to pay. For I sure. pat through the fingers. I know. <laughs> Whatever you decide, it stays between us. I can offer fifty percent. Eddie's enough to do whatever the hell you like. I'll be finished. Dex won't forgive a dirt move like this. Dex isn't the only fixer in town. But my offer's the only one you'll ever get. <sighs> Let me think about it. Mm-hmm. If you need me, call. I'll send you my number. Okay. Good luck. Now go. I need a few words with Judy. Hey, we leveled up again. For doing absolutely nothing. <laughs> so getting our hacks up. Hmm. More damage. Oh yeah. Pretty good. Turns out Evelyn's recording from Compaki was worth our time. Beautiful. T bug already called. Said she's working her match. And the flathead. Nothing yet. On it now. The G Bug says no chance of that ship without that buy. It's a work thing. Okay. Let's exit this place. Is there a problem? No problem at all. No problem. Let's save. It's just been a while. But we're going to end the video here today. So next episode, that's when we're going to be getting that flathead thing. And most likely there's going to be a lot of shooting and stuff. So thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next time.